placards. Abattoir ghoul. So this is some crazy, weird lifelink thing going on, isn't it? I think, kind of. Yeah, so if this guy kills something or yep. stops him jumping, like this. Yeah, I think mean, this card's good. It's got a cool picture, which is a butcher just butchering up some guy. In the abattoir. A 3 2 for 4 is rubbish across the ground. First, First strike, strike makes it a little bit more balanced, then I think that ability just puts it into the good column. Yeah. And I'd happily have this guy if I was in black. Yep. This is a card I like, this next one coming up. Butcher's Reap. See, best thing about this card, instant. <laughs> Sorcery Myers. Yeah, I think this well good. Yeah. I mean, I, I really like Vivisection, and Vivisection was, so it was a sorcery and cost more mana. Yeah. Um, no, I love this. Yeah, it's it's amazing. Pick this card. Good. I love this. <laughs> Army of the Damned. 13 dudes. <laughs> Seriously. It's just annoying. <laughs> it, just, it has flashback as well. <laughs> it's just like, Obviously, when you want to open packs, right, you want mythics. You n I'd never want this. Really? What? I would never take I'd try and make a deck out. 13 dudes. I'd pick this card. 8 mana. I, I, know, I know, but it's Two turns later, you'll really have 20 slow. Slow. It, it is going to be very slow, but 8. Yeah, you pay up turn 8. Turn 10, you've got 26 2-2s. Two I was, was going to say, <laughs> the 13 will do it. I was just saying, as it, flashback, as if uh, 26 damage wasn't enough. Yeah. It's like, why? Bit of hard, which I like one de uh, power death touch card. Yeah, because. Ooh, they're sneaky. It's like. Oh, don't just particularly about... like them for five mana. No. And, and searching a curse when they're yeah. all pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think there are some good ones. I think there might be one good one. It's, I don't know. I need to see. I haven't looked Rubbish at it. Rubbish. What's a better what card to play for. for five would be this one. It's a superb. What is it? Five mana? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, he's ter she's terrible. <laughs> I thought she was like two or three. Three mana, yeah, five. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's Bob almost. <laughs> this card's good, happy with this. Yeah, that's that's really good. I think it's really cool. People were playing, admittedly he's expensive, but people were playing you know, yeah, Dark Confident. Really? Yeah, but it is the equivalent. Like, Dark Confident was you know drawing you a card and losing you life because it was a very mana cost. This guy's only losing you once. So this guy's just winning you the game. Oh, yeah. Just a 5 4 flyer. That's this is one of this is one of the annoying things of like five mana, five four flyer in black with a good ability. Compared with some of the ones it's like, yeah, you lose a game unless <laughs> you do a million different things or you have to sacrifice all your lands. Oh what the Why demons. do they unbalance the demons so much like that? Stupid. Oh double face card and quite a good one at that. Love this vampire. It's, it's a just bit unfair, really. It's just, <laughs> you get dudes and then you get the dude and then you power up the, the dudes. And they're all powered up, and it's a flying anyway. It's, and it's got it's five five, but it's flying, and it's so, costs four. So stupid, so good. By turn four, if you're playing a vampire deck, you're gonna have vampires by that time, aren't you? Mm. But this card just loses to any sort of wrath ability, and because the vampires it makes only two twos, then they'll be. But there's only two. one wrath. There's only one wrath. Yeah, I know. Well, two, and two. that you get to pick him and I'll say no, I don't want. A lot of decks play four. No, I'm talking about this guy. It could be oh standard four four yeah for normal play. Yeah, true, true. I don't think oh, well, it probably well, will go in the vampire deck. Yeah. But. Oh, I, I don't see why it wouldn't be. Playing. I also like the picture because the uh, I think the castle it's sort of the cathedral. We're going to be really critical now, and the whole flip cards thing of day and night. The vampire would not be out in the day. Should be True. night yeah, and night. That's just for the, for werewolves. Huh? That's just for werewolves. The day and night thing. No, but as in the the icons of the corner. Yeah, they are. Oh sort yeah, of sort of yeah. That's the icon they have for it. Yeah, but yeah. yeah. Wow. Um, wizards, wizards, wizards. What was I going to say about this card? One more thing. What happens when you flip? Do you untap or does it stay tapped? It will stay as is. Yeah. As is, is it? So it transfers as it was. Yeah. Okay. So, no, no sneaky shenanigans of getting extra cards. Very, very good cards. Brain Weevil? That sounds hilarious. Go going in your ear. Um, Anytime you can cast a source. It's, so it's, it costs four. It's mind rot on a stick. Basically, it costs four. Hmm. I don't. I don't like this at all. I don't no, I don't. Uh, it's just, it's just, it's just a one-one intimidate for one, but then we mind rot on top. So yeah. I don't know. Probably not great. No, I think this would be better if it was cheap to play. It was a one-one intimidate guy you could beat with, and then, and then the, the money pay yeah, extra pay was yeah sacrifice. Like so the, like the uh, dementia bats, bats yeah. yeah, but they were expensive anyway. Yeah, so better end bats, I think. Yeah. <laughs> that that would that that would be fine, but I'm not a fan of it as is. This is a really flavourful card coming up. What, with Darth Vader in it? Yeah, really <laughs> flavourful. <laughs> no, it's like a vampire or something. No, it's, it's Darth Vader. 
bump in the night, and there's like a strike of lightning coming down as well. Yeah, from the Death Star. The windows are just going <laughs> flung open, and you. I know it's the thing to do, but I hate it when things are in italics and then to do something with a word if they just put it in normal. Because yeah. it just looks stupid. Yeah. But yeah, Darth Vader, I don't believe really, th- this card's alright, it's not really. Yeah, you get six down da- six down. Yeah. Oops. Well your necrogen sensor. Corpse lunge. Cool. It's uh similar similar to Dead Reckoning. Um I'd say it's more like fling on the graveyard. Ooh, Ooh graveyard Ooh. fling. Ooh. That's probably better. Yes, because you don't have to worry about your creature being around. I'd love I'd love this card. I think it's good. I think it's not one of those like as in like it's not doom blade removal or it's not that kind of removal. It's like induced despair kind of. Mm. It's gonna do the job, but you do need the condition. Induced despair was the one we have to reveal the creature cards. Yeah, that's why. Actually, that was exactly what I was gonna compare it to. Oh, it's the same. It, 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 it's, it's, it's very similar to that card, isn't it? But yeah, I like that. It's cool. And you pick that card, so why not pick this one? Curse. This is one of the better curses. Yeah. Yeah, this card's very good. Especially, actually, to be honest, if I had this card, I'd probably get the witch. Go look for it. Because I think the witch's saving grace is that she has death touch, so she can at least trade for something. Yeah. This, this, this so you're, this you know, quite a good card against uh, all little tokens that are going to be generated. I like the depart on here because she's like on the ground and then waves and then oh my god, Being no, something's I'm happening there. I'm sleeping. Uh, yeah, but that's know. one of the worst curses I think yeah well it's, it's trying to hate on the graveyard but why not just have lay down with the void or something like that <laughs> <No>. <laughs> you, you play this with that tone blue curse just like okay I'll build two cards now I'm going to exile them and I'll build two cards and it's a really go. long witch <laughs> like it. <laughs> oh hold on this may be one of those only cards in the set that's actually solid removal dead weight yeah. well it's not really removal it's charming well yeah but it's the same as quag sicknesses it's basically I like this card. I think it's very cool. Yeah, this is this is the kind of card you first pick. Whoa! I wouldn't, well, go, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go that. I wouldn't first pick. It. No, what? no way. It's basically disfigure. Well, it's, uh, you, uh, would you first pick it? It's not removal. In, in Zendikar two. draft, I would first pick first pick disfigure. Zendikar draft. This is in a draft. Disfigure in Eldrazi. No, disfigure is is Zendikar. Card. I don't care. I'm going. That is so first pick material. It's not first pick. pick. It's just minus. All of the white guys, all the common and uncommon white guys, were at least two toughness. Uh, are, uh, you know, max two toughness, that's why. Yeah. Yeah, it's, 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 it's fine. Weak, it'd have to be a weak pack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, Okay, I suppose. Yeah, your rare would have to be pretty tough. It's, it's like shock. Diagraph Ghoul. Diagraphs. Uh, this guy's alright. I don't really think any deck that would run it would just want to do this kind of thing, though. Nah. Cause it's like that whole Murpho Looter thing, it's like, yeah, okay, get five one, that's not bad. But that's not what you want to be doing. I'm pretty sure this deck would not want to be doing that either. It wants to cast a billion zombies with And go. Yeah, on that thirteen thing. Disciple of Grizzlebrand. Interesting guy. He seems to have some cloth over his eyes, so I don't know what he's reading. Someone's pulled the wool over his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good card though, I like this. Really? Uh, well, yeah, leaving it at one is is usually yeah, always doable. Yeah, but why would you want to sacrifice your creature and just gain no, life? No, you do it as if it's going to die. Yep. Yeah, but when... Okay, but okay, so the only time they die is to removal, so why would you want to do it? That's the only, that's the time you want to do it, but like, so like you're trading life. to trade. No, you, you do it if, just, you're, if you're blocking. Yeah, yeah, but you'd always want to try to set it up so you kill something. I don't know, I think he's not as good as... I think that other card was better. Endless ranks of the dead. This card is amazing. Yep. Just because it's just get, you get you get zombies. I love zombies. You get quite a lot of zombies. You do get quite after a, lot. a few turns. See, yeah. I, would, I wouldn't first pick this. I thought oh. you would. Really? Yeah. yeah. If you can, if you can, st- if you can push the zombies. If it was six, like, like those other enchantments, I wouldn't pick it. But, but X is half the four. number of zombies you control, rounded down. So if you've got one, two. one doesn't do anything. So two yeah. does. So if you get two, then you'd get one so zombie. Get one. Then you'd get one zombie. Then you get yeah. two. Two, three. Uh, yeah, it gets you. Yeah, it's out of control. If you, if you, if you've got this and you pick up zombies, then you're gonna win. Yeah, yeah, full stop. I don't know. I don't know if it'd be pack one, pick one material. But mm. if you go through the first pack, you've got zombies. You think, oh, I, I think. It, I, think it, I think if you pick it, you've got to say, okay, I'm gonna be blue black because that's that's where you, that's where your zombies are, obviously. So. Yeah. 
that's the thing about a lot of these cards where they're reliant on creature types it, it really does tie you into either blue black or white green or green red or so on and so forth or blue red yeah Falcon yeah. Wrath Noble it's pretty cool it's yeah. a 2-2 two, two fly for 4 again with a cool ability it's, a, it's, yeah. it's not an ability that's going to win you the game but I think it's a, it's a good do little bits yeah. of here and there. Sure, it's for black. That's pretty damn good for a fly. Yeah. Well, and you don't have to fire. pay fifty million life oh. and sacrifice oh. all, oh. Oh. It's all gone blue. the creatures. This is a key word here. Ooh. Vampire. vampire. These very vampiric. Ghoul cooler's chant. He's coming out of his tomb. Hey, <laughs> don't like sorceries. That zombie's gay. What? It's like coming out of the closet. It's coming out of his tomb instead. Oh, Joe, that was... <laughs> Joe. going to have to cut that out and apologise to... Oh, no, really I know, I know. So uh, that was just a terrible, terrible pun. Um, it's just... Do you reckon this guy, the, that one's been helped out by the Ghoul Razor? Definitely. Ghoul Razor's awesome. It's a good, that's a good picture. Yeah. Um, Again, it's good, but I wouldn't go awesome. That's, that's why I said good. Awesome. The, the word awesome is fling, it's flung around too often these days. Okay, <laughs> it's annoying there's in like Gravedigger and this guy, you don't want to play him on turn three, so him costing one less than Gravedigger for a limiting thing mm. doesn't really matter because you're not going to play it on turn three, huh? Yeah. Ever. And you can kind of set it up because you, you know, if you have him in your starting hand, you play him second, you're always going to get your choice of the zombie. And his spade isn't straight, I don't like that. He used a bendy bit of wood on his face. Damn you, Steve Prescott. Gruesome deformity. Looking into the yeah. pensive. Interesting. Meh. Creature enchantment. Yeah. I think I think if you had it in draft, you sideboard it in against the white green deck and just make your go and block ball. Yeah. That's fine. I can see that happening. Oh, pardon me. I'm yawning. Next card is Petrifying Arts. This is amazing. I was reading, you know, somewhere like if you had two of these out and then played someone to the macro you're playing three mana just to play to get ramp and growth and then draw a guard it's pretty awesome yeah but then none of your guys are going to be able to kill anything no because you know you just then just play like some crazy bomb because you get two mana off and losing one strength into one toughness is pretty cool because you can start playing some of the more crazy costing cards because you're losing four mana off and then play Paracelia and destroy all the enchantments and just yeah oh yeah yeah yeah. well you could vent up link out the way yeah it's good. I think I like it. Oh, 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 oh first planeswalker. <laughs> She's good. She's amazing. Very good. Very good. I love free mana. I don't. I don't think, think the uh, what's it called ever gonna happen. No, it's not. Yeah. No. It'd be cool no. if it did. I don't mind planeswalkers that don't have good ultimates. Well, no, it's a good ultimate, and, it, and ones that will never be used for their ultimate. I mean, what planeswalkers are used for their ultimates? Really? No. Yeah. Well, yeah, like cough. Cough is the only one, but yeah. that's really realistic because it's only two steps away, isn't it? Um, but like yeah, no one really uses Vensa for its own map because it, it's maybe, too hard to get to. Yeah. Yep. Liliana, good. Play it early, kill the guy. But if you do, use, if you use the ultimate, you win the game. I think, but the thing to do with uh, these kind of cards is just break down, like you said earlier, about you're getting draw card, draw card, rapid growth, rapid growth from playing the simulacrums with that yeah. thing. Break it down to what this is: three mana to kill a guy. Yeah. Uh, then it's probably still going to be there next turn, and then you get to. Made them discard a card. Yeah, you have to discard one as well. But well, you obviously build it around that. Yeah, plan, that's, a, that, that, that's quite a lot of value just out of the mm -hmm. small investment. Plus, it's fog. Our favourite little turn to go and play to this. <laughs> if anything, oh no, look at the come with this turn. I've got to play for it. Mana skeleton. No, why have haste? <laughs> At least in mana, isn't it? May and there. No. Why does this have haste? Mana <laughs> or? Because it's because it's a pirate skeleton. He's off. He's going. <laughs> Got his candle. He's going, going to get you. Candle? Why does he have a candle? To you see. can see where he's going. <laughs> Come on, you see his He doesn't have eyes. <laughs> <laughs> he can't see anything. But I don't think it's ever going to be a situation where you think, oh, I'm <laughs> going to get that man. Let's get a loud break. <laughs> it's like he said, he's not going to attack me with anything. Don't worry. I, 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 I can swing at him. Okay, he untaps. That man is going to. No, <laughs> I've lost that. <laughs> Stupid card. Uh, it's uh, a bigger child of Markov Patrician. Yeah, I think the best thing about Child of Night is that it's two mana. Yeah. Not the fact that it's a. Yeah, paying one extra mana for one extra power. Yeah, especially when the toughness hasn't scaled. That's annoying. Yeah. If it was like a 6 6, then. Yeah, maybe. It'd be pretty, pretty good. <laughs> it's also a really bad picture. It'd maybe go if it was 4 1. Yeah. Mm. 
Yeah. I'd rather have like it be more tough at this point. What about two two? No, more like three two. I mean. They should have pushed it. For I three think two two would have been alright. Yeah. But but anyway. If it was a three two, it would have just been a better barony vampire, which is a card that they should make good players. Yeah. More of the Maya. This is a picture. Of oh, boy. well done, Joe. He's got one right. Now he knows. <laughs> <laughs> it's just your melt terrain. Yeah. Yeah. I don't really like. Yeah. I just decided to put something extra onto the destroy target land. Yeah. Moan of the unhallowed. This get two right. two zombie creatures. This gets you an extra one out of the uh, thing of the damned. I think uh, the best way to describe this is fair. Four, mm. four, 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 fair. four, four, yeah. four. I think the uncommon factor is the fact that it's got uh, flashback. Flash yeah. Fine. No, good card. Fair enough. Two twos are usually good throughout the entire game. Fair enough. More for the banshee. This guy's ridiculous as well. It's like a four four. If it had flying, it'd be awesome. You got. I think you got to be wary of this guy. If someone swings at you and it looks a bit questionable, you're like, and they're black. It's like, oh, he's my, he might have that banshee, especially yeah, uncommon. Yeah. He's probably gonna have that banshee and just blow you out a little bit. Or it's an awesome way to do a crazy bluff. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, now he's gonna morbid morker banshee me. She's got massive. Take all the damage. <laughs> Easy, Joe. <laughs> What's going on in the face? Just like she's got a mate, a face melt going on there. Yeah, so oh. here's one of those like the mummy hands. Night terrors. Looks it's very just, much like this thing next to her is casting the shadow. Yeah. yeah. Night terrors is just too expensive. Too Yeah. Okay. Does it's it basically distress. It's like just, exile. Yeah. Exile. It's just for one extra mana. Yeah. Nah. Yeah, Pass. Nah. I don't know why these effects, these duress, thoughts, these effects like that, are always non-land and never. Uh, because that, and then they're just equivalent to stone rain, aren't they? Really? Yeah, but if you just steal their lands. I think I think you should be allowed. Full stop. Mm. No, because then they're basically just you know a one mana stone rain. Yeah. Because you're making them skip their mana or whatever. I think they may have realised that. We shouldn't start. We shouldn't slate the demons, and they should have good abilities from there. Yeah, probably. <laughs> I think they've been listening to us. This yeah. is just a bigger one of these with flying. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that banshee doesn't have flying. Just no. as a f oh. oh wow. Okay. Oh. Um, Did you not hear me say if it had flying, it would be awesome? No. Yeah. Oh right. I thought it had flying. I thought oh, it was I'm gonna, awesome. I'm gonna re retract some praise from that card. You just see banshee and you think flying. Yeah. Oh. Moving on. Banshees don't fly. They float. Ah. <laughs> 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 Reaper from the Abyss, I think it is very good. <laughs> the name is amazing. I think you would first pick this card. Black 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 Black. I think you would be a fool not to. Yeah. Unless the pack was filled with black cards and you were like, oh, I'm I think you still would. Yeah. I think I think the most important thing about that card is the beginning of each end step. So yeah. yep. you're just killing things left, right, and center with that. All over the place. Dross snake. Rotting fen snake. How many mouths does this thing want? It's got a few. What's it doing? <laughs> it's basically falling apart. He's like. Look at this bit here. It's just nothing on it. It's pretty cool. Uh, I don't like. Which bit? Point to it again, so that people. Well, you, I thought you were going to move <laughs> the mouse. I was like this, and I was like. What were you like? Which <laughs> ah, I was pointing towards the bit where the his sort of entrails are sort of falling out of him. Too late. No, no. <laughs> Mate, you're such a luddite. Wee. Like this card confuses me. Yeah. Why would you ever want to change it back? Because flying. Like, flying. Yeah. But yeah. Well, if you if you yeah, if you, if you can beat on the floor, that's good. I like how it's three to play then four to transform because you can do it the next turn. It's good. Nice card. You play it for free. Turn four, you attack for two, and then leave your mana up and transform into a five. <laughs> <laughs> what? I can't get over it. <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> I've seen this so many nice. times. It just still cracks me up every time. <laughs> I haven't actually seen this picture yet. It's so good. Let's ignore set of the blood like his art is so bad. Uh, what does it do? Who cares? Get a grimace. <laughs> Let's go over here. <laughs> Some of the bloodline is actually really good though. Uh, Exile target creature and all other creatures with the same name as that creature. That's that's really good. That's yeah. a four mana kill spell. That's a four mana sorcery. Uh, and flashback. Kill well. anything. Um, like any, got more any, than any, one. Any creature, of course. Yeah, and yeah, you've got tokens, then bye. Bye. If only it wasn't a sorcery, because then you might even see it in standard, because you know, everyone plays copies. The story of magic, if only it wasn't a sorcery. <laughs> Let me get that tattooed on. Why is Skeletal Grimace? <laughs> it's That's a, a good enchantment. Turns into his gun. <laughs> Why has he got his burrow hat off? 
<laughs> Skeletons are clearly pirates in Inner Strand. <laughs> no, I, I think this the hat has a name. I don't know what it is, though. It's, it's, it's a weird what, like a name like James? Or, <laughs> or like the name of a hat? <laughs> what was that Facebook profile? Was a hat? Patrick the Cowboy Patrick hat. the Cowboy hat. <laughs> no, that's a total <laughs> private joke. Right. Right, this guy. Skizdag High Priest. He's making demons, so he's always good. Good. good five, card. five black demons. Seen those tokens? Yep. It's a good card. Precursor to this card. Mmm. What fan? Very good. I like cheap rares. Yeah. yeah. Cheap mana cost. Yeah. Uh, well, Bird. Yeah, but his morbid cost is oh, steep. God. You tap him, and cheap. then tap two other creatures to get a five, five, and someone had to die that turn. Yeah, but then you get five, five black. Oh yeah, no, yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah, it's good, but, but if you yeah, do it in their turn, it's better. You've got to kill something, and you've got to have two. You have to have three creatures, including him, out, and you have to tap them all down. Just remember. I'm remembering, John. Good. It's good. Let's move on to st- strong Remind code patrol. I'm not going to. No, I'll watch back the video. Don't worry. Rubbish. Good. Rubbish. Really? Rubbish. Oh yeah, it's five mana. Okay, yeah. It's, it's a billion mana. Yeah, it's, just, it's better than the zombie life, though. I suppose it's just a compare. You can go in your black soldier deck though if you're looking for that. Vampire as well. Yeah. Tribute to hunger. Yeah, you take it because it's, okay. it's kind of removal, and you need some in your deck. Yeah, uh, it's guest verdict all over again, isn't it? For yeah. more. I, 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 I still like guest verdict. Yeah. yeah. I'd still take it. I think yeah. Typhoid rat's pretty cool. Little dude, get you. Death touch. <laughs> Can't attack him to me. No problem with that. Those time. rats are everywhere. They just ransack that They're pretty relentless, those rats. Are. No, they're Would not quite say? relentless. Unbreakable. No, unbreathing horde. Wow. That's a cool picture. It's for zombies. That's really, really, really grim. There's like a little kid on the left. Yeah. It's terrible. Terrible, terrible. terrible. <laughs> this is like, this should be called Zombie Hydra. Yeah. Because that's what it is. Counters and stuff. I don't think it's that good. Nah. Again, you play zombies then. Because of the Hydra thing. It's, it's, a, it's threat, like. Threat, chump block. Oh, it's worse. It's threat, chump block. Oh, no, it's now just game. It's Phyrexian Hydra all over again, and that card was annoying as hell. If that card hits you, you're going to win. No, but it, it doesn't them. ever. It doesn't ever. It's five mana. They have guys by then. Yeah. That's the problem. And he just gets smaller and smaller, and like your burn spells are good still because you're just slowly working him down. It's just. No. Burn spells turn into like burn, in fact. Yeah. Unburial rights. This card's very Ooh. good. Flashback for cheaper than this mana cost is yeah. so cool. Because mm. if you're milling it, you're like, oh, actually, I'm just gonna like you can actually have it. I don't know. Is there is there a bad way? It's like a, a deck where it's a white deck and you're not even got black and you're milling it into. Your I don't think they do that. Even though I'm pretty sure that the birthing pod decks could afford to play one. They in, well, they in, take birds, don't they? So they yeah, get the in green. the um, what's it called in the band birthing pod decks, they should still play skin renderer for one skin renderer if they need it, mm. even though it's not going to come up. With I, I think I agree with what you said there, John. With that. Vampire interloper. Meh. Yeah. Can't block. May as well attack with it, I suppose. Yeah. The only problem with it is it kind of looks like a uh, Twilight vampire rather than an actual vampire. Yeah. Damn Twilight. There's going to be so many Twilight industries. You're not going to like the picture for the next one, Lou. Nope. Johnny Kamigawa again. No, as in <laughs> blood yeah. everywhere. He's a victim of the. Oh yeah, but I also think this guy looks like what's I don't know what it's from. Is it from Doctor Who? Ming the. No, the, that's, what's that's that from? Flash, jo- flash whatever. Jo- it looks like him. Ming the merciless. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> he does a little. Yeah, I'll give you that. Especially his little like collar thing going around there. It's good though. Uh, Targets those specific guys of which there are a lot. Yeah. No. Yeah. It's it's. It's the human killer. Village cannibals. Another one of these just human. Should it be human like gang? Shouldn't it? Yeah. Human gang. Creature humans. <laughs> well, another human creature dies, but I put some casual on it. Well, yeah. There's a lot of that with a lot of different things. And this one's black for some reason. Yeah. yeah. No, no, walking corpse. The human deck, so. That's just a solid zombie, isn't it? Yeah. Really? Two, two for two. Zombie walk, bear. Walk, walking bear. They so should have made it some sort of undead bear. Bear corpse. Oh, that's it. <laughs> zombie bear. Zombie bear. Yeah, I call it under and call it walking zombie bear. Walking <laughs> zombie bear. Walking zombie rune claw bear. I put that portion. I want in brackets, but black. <laughs> <laughs> so I think it's red after black. So stay tuned for those. Goodbye.